Are you looking for a snorkel to take with you on your travel adventures? I have one here that a company sent to me and I want to unbag it for you. It's kind of like an unboxing, except it's not in a box. <laughs> but first of all, hi. Hi to all the new dads here. This is Dad Reviews. This is where I give you my uh, unedited, hopefully more authentic review of the products that I like, use, and have. And so, uh, if you like that, you might want to click that subscribe button. But today, we have, uh, like I said, an unbagging here. It's this uh, easy snorkel thing. They sent it to me. Uh, I was really interested because, if y'all don't know, we have another channel where we do uh, a lot of traveling type stuff. And uh, our kids are learn get at an age where they're learning how to swim and all that type of stuff. So, uh, I really wanted to test out this uh, this snorkel here. So it comes in this little bag here. This one's a little bit different from your traditional snorkels, and that's why I was so interested in it. So uh, it comes in just a, a little bag here, easy snorkel. Um, and then it has this, this is nice, a little carrying bag, <laughs> so that you can have everything contained. I like that. It'd be kind of nice if this was more one of those like book sack bags, so that you could, uh, you could wear it like a book sack. Let's see, let's see what we have in here. All right, so there's, whoa, this thing here. Okay, let me take everything out of the bag here so I can get out of my lap. And then you have, this looks like big mask thing there. We have a little card here. And we got a little, oh, a little, uh, looks like a GoPro attachment. I forgot it had that. So this is the bag that it comes with. It's mesh on one side, can y'all see that? Mesh on one side full plastic on the other um, and it's got it does have a little hangy hook thing here so I guess that's good if you need to like dry it out or something like that if it gets wet I really like that feature or I guess you could maybe get a carabiner and clip that closed although you could use this to just clip it closed as well um, nice little bag here this is the, the large and extra large you have to measure your nose to your chin to be able to figure out what size you need um, this is version 3 with the video and camera mount on it. That's why it has the uh, GoPro uh, little accessories here. So if you have a GoPro, you may want to get that. It just comes with a little nougat here and then a couple of gaskets and whatnot and the, the little nut to hold it all together. This is the actual snorkel part here from what I'm understanding about this thing from what I watched online. Uh, comes with a little bag. It's a... Uh, little ball right there okay I don't know why they have a ball there and then this is the mask here which this is intense I feel like I'm playing Mortal Kombat here and I've got a uh, you know like Sub-Zero's mask on <laughs> this is pretty cool okay cool all right uh, nice uh, it seems like it gives a nice seal water tightness all the way around uh, I'm curious to know how this is going to work for me being that I have chin hair here So like a dad who has a beard or something like that if it would get the same kind of seal there uh, Seals along the bridge of the nose, and then you have your eye seal there um, So this thing basically attaches to the top here Hmm, okay, hold on No, it goes that way Ah, there we go. I just wasn't pressing hard enough on it. There we go. All right. So this is the snorkel part. It stays on the top, and the air goes throughout your whole mouth. So you can breathe through your nose or your mouth, which is super cool. So let me put this on again. All right. I really want to test this out in a body of water. Uh, it's just cold right now. Can y'all hear me? I'm assuming y'all can hear me. <laughs> Oh yeah, I can feel the, the suction on this. I'm breathing, yeah, this is cool. And you could just breathe. I see it fall, a, a little bit of a fog up there whenever I'm breathing through there, but I'm, I would assume that whenever you get underwater that might change. Uh, this is really cool. I like this because you don't have to have that whole snorkel thing going on. This just sticks up out of the water. You know, you'd be looking down and you'd be looking straight up, you know. And I like how you can use your mouth and your nose so that, uh, uh, you know, it's, especially for kids. If, if they make a kid's, I don't think they make a kid's mask, but if they did, that'd be cool. Uh, so that kids would just not be as afraid uh, in the water with it. Uh, it does have some... Uh, Tighteners here, so you can tighten it around your face. 
a good elastic. I really like this. A big, strong piece of elastic there. It's nice and wide. I'm going to put it on again. All right. Oh, yeah, that's a lot tighter. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you can really tighten it up. Oh, yeah, look, this goes over my beard. So, uh, I shouldn't have any problems using it. <laughs> this is cool. I like this. What do y'all think? Is that a good, is that, is this something that you'd be interested in? I think that that's pretty neat. I like, because whenever I go snorkeling, usually, you know, you take the snorkel out and it kind of flip-flops around on that little piece of plastic that it has, and then half the time you lose the thing and you just have the mask or vice versa. So this makes it like an all-in-one thing. Now, the other thing that's super cool about this is that on the top here, since it takes up a lot of your face, is that you can uh, use, here look, I'll just take it from here. I have a GoPro here, and you can just attach that right to here. I need to get the little nougat to put it all the way on, but come on now. There we go. And then they give you the little nougat in here to, to tighten it up and whatnot, but that's really cool. So you could have this pointing down at you in the face, which would be kind of fun, or out into the sea so you can capture the wildlife that you're there. Uh, I mean, if you wanted to, I guess you could turn it around this way and see this, how the snorkel works. You could, I don't know, bubbles come out or whatever, you may already see behind you. Ah, that's really cool. I like that. I like how versatile it is. It would be kind of nice if it was on like a ball kind of thing. So in case you wanted to like underwater, if you wanted to catch something to the side, you could turn it or if you wanted to, you know, just have different perspectives. Um, but I guess you could just turn your head. So that's kind of whatever. Um, and I think because it's underwater, the metal and whatnot would get messed up and whatnot. This is really cool. I like this. If you guys want to check out Easy Snorkel, I'm going to link them up down in the description below. Uh, if you guys want to learn a little bit more about them. I really like this. I think this is super cool. I can't wait to test it out whenever we're able to get back into some more water. And um, I'll be sure to give you guys a full review of how it worked out for me, you know, with the beard and the suction and all that and the GoPro. I'll probably get some GoPro footage from it, put it up on my other channel. Um, so look for that soon. If you guys, well, not soon. <laughs> it depends on if we can get into some water or not, but look for that hopefully soon. Uh, thank you guys for watching. If y'all have another product that you want us to review on the channel, let me know down in the comments below what it is. Also, if you want to watch more videos from us, there's two more videos right there on the screen. We would love to have you as a subscriber. That's what that little circle there in the middle is for. Uh, thank you guys for watching. Thumbs up is always appreciated. And dad out.